Oh, 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 snap, guys. Freaking jackpot. What's up, guys? It's Ryantium here, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. That's right, you guys, we are back in Seven Days to Die, and oh man, am I so freaking excited for today. But first, if you guys enjoy what you're about to see, holy storm, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more daily videos, and if you haven't done already, follow me on Twitter at CouchPotato1898. Link is down there in the description. So, I am filming this episode right after the episode that went up yesterday, Wednesday, because on Wednesday I actually had a medical procedure and I, I did it because just in case something, God forbid, went wrong, I needed a video for today, so that's why I'm doing it today. So if you guys left good comments on the video on Wednesday, that is why I did not um, apply those comments to this episode, so that's why. Just wanted to get that out in the beginning of the episode, um, and yeah, so anyways. Last episode, guys, we did a lot, a lot, a lot of looting. Like, not even kidding. We got set up pretty dang well. So, down on our bar, we have a brand new iron fire axe. And I am so freaking pumped to use that thing. So, I think we need to start off the episode by going into this, this brand new house that we found. And try and see what's inside of here. So, I think there was... there. There's supposed to be zombies up here. I know there are. I think I shot one of them and they were following me, like, down the... down the hill. So, I'm not sensed or anything, but that's a basement. Oh, snap, guys. It's got a bunch of stuff going for it. So, there's a wooden door right there. Let's go ahead and check the outer area first before we go inside. Because I'm pretty sure there's going to be a zombie in there. I have no doubt that there will be a zombie in there. But if this yields good stuff, guys, then we are going to be good to go. But I figure once noon ticks over, we can go out and get that supply drop. Because last episode, we were supposed to go out and get a supply drop. But uh, but no, it disappeared. So, oh, hello, mailbox. What do we got? Paper. Why in the hell do you need paper? I don't understand what paper is used for. And I don't feel like opening this thing again. Because the last time I opened one of those things, there was nothing in it. All right, so let's see. Uh, can we break down this door with my fire axe? Oh, it's unlocked. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, let's see. Uh, any bad hombres inside of here? That's a pretty crappy chimney. Okay, so, it's not, it's not sounding like there's anything inside of here. Is that unlocked? That's unlocked. Good. So, it doesn't sound like there's anything bad in here. Hello, toilet. What do we got? Is that murky water? It is murky water. Okay, that's good. I can make it not murky water. All right, let's see. What do we got? Nothing in there. Nada. Nothing. So, so far, kind of lackluster place. What do we got in the fridge? Anything good? Cans? I'll take the cans. Nothing. A couple cans. Okay, I'll take more cans. That's fine. Oh, okay. Glass jars. That's very good. Old sink. What? Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. My God. That is a 252 wrench. Oh my freaking lord. We just found a wrench, guys. Oh my god. Okay, so let me read you what the wrench does, because I was actually just reading this on the wiki. Great for disassembling mechanical devices like cars, air conditioners, and more. Can also be used to repair and upgrade walls. Now, the significance of you being able to break down cars and air conditioners and stuff like that is because you get way more metal and gasoline whenever you use a wrench than you, you ever would by using an axe or anything like that. So, we just hit the major freaking jackpot, guys. Like, not even kidding. Major jackpot, and we're only four minutes into the episode. That is insanity! That's a really nice bed. Hello. What do we got here? Can I break this bed down for cloth fragments? Oh, I can Oh my god! Are you seeing the amount of cloth I just got? I have 16 cloth fragments in my freaking inventory now. Holy Jesus! That's amazing. So, I want to continue with uh, with looting today, mainly because, like I said in the last episode, guys, we've got to get more stuff. We've got to get stuff. Like, if we can get a pistol or, like, a sawed-off shotgun, we're going to be sitting pretty, you guys. Let's see. Does that do more damage, or does this? Surprisingly, the stone axe does more damage. That's kind of shocking. But anyways, we need to get something better than the equipment that we already have. So... 
with the armor, we're good to go on the armor. We don't necessarily need to, like, look for armor or stuff like that. Like, I'll take better armor if I find it. Absolutely. Absolutely. But I don't necessarily need it. <gasps> That's water. There's water underneath of this house. Oh, guys. That's a water source. Okay. We might need to go down there. It, there's a basement. Yeah, there's the entrance right there. <gasps> oh, guys. What do we got down here? This isn't terrifying at all. What do we got? Okay. There's a dead body down there. Oh, guys. Oh, we can fill up our glass jars down. That is disturbing as shit. Not even kidding. That is so disturbing. We can fill up our glass jars in here. Thank God zombies can't swim. At least I think they can't. Not in this game. I don't think they can. Please let me know if they can swim in, down in the comments. Please. Let's see. Can I turn this? What's going on with this thing? I can hit it. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Um, okay. We got a tra trash pile. Got some feathers in there. That's good. Looks like... Oh, there's another doorway right there. <gasps> Ooh, hello. Okay, are these anything? No, that's nothing. Okay, but there's another door right there. And it's unlocked. What do we got? In okay, we need to get some air before we go inside of there. Ah, that just rhymed. Oh, I'm a poet and I didn't even know it. All right, let's get some air. We're good to go. And let's go ahead and head in. Okay, so what do we got inside of here? Uh, I am... Oh, I oh, there's a freaking gun safe down here, guys. That's a damn gun safe. Oh, I want in. I never did go back and uh, open that gun safe back at the uh, the military base. Is there air in here? There's not. That's why there's a gun safe in here. Because you can drown inside of here. Okay, we need oxygen, like, right now. Right now! Please give me oxygen. Thank you. Okay, we might have to come back and get that, guys. We've got to come back and get that. But we can so fill up our water jars here and get unlimited water. That's so freaking perfect. There's a toilet right there. I need to check that bad boy. Come here, toilet. What do you got? Murky water. Perfect. I will take it. Oh, guys, this was definitely worth it because we found a water source, and that makes me very happy. All right, so I tell you what. Let me get some of these water bottles filled up. I'm actually going to go back to the base and get some of the empty water bottles, and uh, I'm going to fill these bad boys up, and then we're going to go out and look for some more stuff, guys. So I'll see you soon. All right, you guys. So I have some exciting freaking news. Our health and wellness is going absolutely incredible. So check this out. Inside of here, I have... I think I have, let's see, 9, 10, 11 goldenrod teas being made up. Now, goldenrod tea, apparently, it, it, it increases or it gives you 40 stamina plus 20 hydration plus 0.2 wellness. But the one reason I'm brewing it is in case I get dysentery. Now, I could also use this as a main source of water because we have so much freaking goldenrod around us. But there's really no need because if you'll notice inside of our food chest we have seven bottles of water we have three glass jars we've got two yucca we've got two yucca juice and, and 11 goldenrod teas but on my bar i have 15 yucca juice that is insanity i also made bacon and eggs i made some more charred meat we've got cat food we've got tallow we've got can of peas i thought that said can of piss uh okay and look at what I have in my inventory, guys, a bellows. So now the only thing that we need to make uh, the forge, I believe, is clay. And would you look at this? I found ourselves a flashlight. Look at that. So it shows so much area, too. Like, let me show you the freaking brightness on this damn thing. So, yeah, you've got you've got the you've got the mining helmet and stuff like that. But the flashlight is ridiculous. Look at how bright this is. You can... <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Have you been drinking? I need to see your ID. It's ridiculous, guys. There's so much freaking good stuff that we got inside of all of this stuff. Like, we've got new shirts. we got some blueberries. we got some tallow. We have eight more animal hide. We have pistol receivers. I think we can build a pistol soon, guys. We just need to find the... Uh, we just got to find whatever... Uh, like the the schematic and stuff like that. So we're we're sitting pretty guys, but we need more I, I want more stuff guys. And so I think our health and uh, our, our food and water. Yep It's basically at 100% guys. So we are ready to head out now. Where do we want to head out to? Well, let's go ahead and check our map I don't want to go back into the desert because God knows we're just gonna drop dead if we go into the desert So I'm thinking we follow this road 
up, let's see, uh, what direction is that? That's north. This will be northwest, most likely, uh, I believe. Yeah, it'll be, you know, I think it's northeast. Northeast is, well, no, it's northwest, yeah. We're going northwest up the road, and um, we're going to check out some uh, some areas up there. Hopefully, hopefully, we run into, like, a town or something like that with, like, a bunch of buildings, because that, then we'd be sitting pretty as far as loot goes. Now, my inventory is fairly, it's fairly empty. It's got some slots in there that are, or it's got most slots empty, but I wish I had a completely empty inventory. Now, I was thinking about going back and getting that gun safe in there, but you know what? I think once we get back to base, I'm going to play it safe and go back to that military base and get the gun safe that's there. I'm not going to try and swim under the water and get that gun safe because it's a little bit too risky for me at the moment. And I don't know if there's a way to increase oxygen or anything like that. So I don't want to chance anything at this moment, especially with all this good stuff on me. Are you freaking kidding me? But I wanted to take this time and test out the wrench. So let's see. We'll go ahead and take the splint off my bar. I have a splint on my bar just in case, God forbid, I accidentally fall off of a building or fall down a hill. Or something because you can you can repair a sprained ankle or broken leg like that so it's good to have on you just in case now I killed one of these guys uh, after that last episode after I cut I killed one of these guys on the ground by shooting him just like that I wanted that to happen thank you so freaking much game yeah apparently once they're on the ground if you get a good enough shot you can kill them in one shot on the ground so check this out bottom right guys we're getting short iron pipes, we're getting iron, and we're getting gasoline. Look at how much we're getting, though. Like, look at what's under our inventory. 106. Isn't that insanity? Let's check this car. What do we got? Please be good. Oh my freaking god. Holy shit. A sledgehammer? <laughs> oh my god. I am straight up thoring this shit. Oh my god. Are you freaking serious, man? Look at all the good stuff we're getting, guys. Like, this is incredible. Now, I don't know if I'm going to keep all of this stuff. Because, truthfully, we don't really need it right now. Like, the gasoline, I might drop. I might keep the iron, though. Uh, because, truthfully, we're going to need to start getting into iron once we have the forge and stuff like that. So, let's see. What all do we have? What is that? Oh, my God. We got a radiator. We got two, spot two headlights. That's kind of cool. We got iron. No, truthfully, you know what? We'll drop the iron... We'll drop, we'll drop, hmm, let's drop these cloth fragments, we've got 35 back at the house, and what's this for, brass objects, okay, this is just a brass uh, item, and we'll drop the gasoline too, so I just kind of wanted to show that to you guys and show you exactly what the, uh, the wrench did, but guys, we got a damn sledgehammer, holy crap, I think I'm going to replace the wrench with that, so... Let's go, let's go do some more looting, guys. I think I'm gonna run up the road a little bit and see if we can't uh, find a cool place to start looting. So, I'll see you soon. Okay, so, quick change of plans. We're going into the desert first because I'm going to get this airdrop, but as soon as I came over here to this airdrop, there's a second one. Another one dropped. I don't exactly know if that was a glitch or what happened, but guys, supply drop time. Let's, let's look inside. Alright, so what do we got? We got painkillers, medkits. Antibiotics, a beaker, first aid. What is this? MacGyver's MacDiver's book. Recipe, scrap boots, scrap leg. Oh, oh, oh! Hello, that's scrap armor. That's good stuff. And this is a sniper rifle barrel. Oh, 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 oh my God. Okay, that's good stuff. And then we're gonna go and get this second one. I don't exactly know where this one came from. Maybe this was the first one that dropped like two episodes ago. But it just didn't pop up. Maybe it was glitched or something like that. I don't- I have no idea. Don't have any idea what's going on with that. But there it is. It's just coming down right now, and it just landed. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Oh my god, guys. Two supply drops in one day, and now we're going looting out past the, uh, out in another forest biome. Oh god, you guys. We are gonna be sitting so damn pretty. Let's see. Can I drink one of these yuccas? I can. Perfect. Cool me down. There we go. Okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and search the supply crate. All right, what do we got? More painkillers, more med, more med kits, antibiotics, beakers, med kits, rocket launcher stock. Oh my god! And an AK-47 schematic. No fucking way! <laughs> oh my gosh! Holy shoot! Okay, let's go ahead and read that. Learn how to assemble, repair, and augment AK-47 assault rifles by reading this schematic. 
Oh, you guys, this was worth it. This was so freaking worth it. It was worth it just for the medical supplies alone. Look at how much medical stuff we have, guys. We have 10, we have 15, 16 med kits, 18 painkillers, and 17 antibiotics, guys. We are so freaking golden, guys. It's not even funny. We are so freaking golden. All right, so I'm going to run back to base, drop this stuff off, and uh, I'll meet you guys northwest of the, uh, the main road. <laughs> oh, snap, guys. Freaking jackpot. Oh, my God. What is this? This is a gas store? Oh, wait, no. We got Shamway Foods. We got food, guys. And what's this? Poppin' pills? That's a... Oh, that's a medical office. <gasps> oh, guys. There's a pig. There he is. Let me get you, pig. I want to shoot you. Quit running. Quit running, you damn little pig. Damn. <laughs> oh, my God. That's funny. So, I managed to pick up, like... I think 11, 10 or 11 chrysanthemum. So if it's good stuff, guys, uh, then uh, we're going to be sitting pretty with chrysanthemum. That is for damn sure. I looked at its uh, its red tea recipe inside of the, uh, the, the campfire, and it said something along the lines of, like, the same thing as the yucca. So what we could do is instead of going back into the desert, we could just come up here to the forest, get the yucca, and go from there. There's a deer up there as well. You see him? He's walking right there. Hello there, Mr. Buddy. How you doing? Oh, man, I missed him. Gosh, it's so hard. There we go. Oh, my God. I just one-shotted him. Oh, I'm freaking MLG freaking... Holy crap. MLG, seven days to die. <laughs> oh, my freaking God. That was awesome. Okay. Well, we need to do some major looting inside of these, inside of these stores, guys, because... Holy Jesus. There's going to be some great stuff here, man. Some great stuff. We'll go ahead and drop these bones since we don't need those either. But guys, we got some major animal hide. Oh, there's gas barrels right there. Ooh. To blow them up or not to blow them up. It would be an easier way in. That's for damn sure. But should I save them? I think I should save them just in case. And I think that's what I'm going to do. Let's go ahead and pick up these gas barrels. And instead of going into that metal door, let's go in through here. Let's see. Okay, that does a decent amount of damage. Perfect. And can we go inside through there? Nope, we need to break off one more. That's okay. That's... Oh, I'm so, I'm found. What am I... I'm hunted by something. Okay, she's right there. Okay, good, good, good. I was like, uh, something, something found me. Can I one-shot you? I didn't one-shot you. Damn it. Oh, I two-shotted her, though. <laughs> oh, my freaking God. I am sadistic as shit. Okay, let's see. Uh, oh, there's another gas barrel. Hello! Three gas barrels, guys. I think we have a total of five. We have two back at home, so oh my god, guys. We have so many gas barrels. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and walk over this. What goes down here? Nothing. Stair it's the stairway to nothing. It's not the stairway to... Oh, hello. Hello! What do we got? What is that? Oh, repair kits? Oh, ho, 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 ho. hello. That's some good stuff. What do we got here? Man-eater challenge. What's this? A strange note I found while looting. It's from the crazy Jake clan. Okay. Well, uh, let's go ahead and take it. What is? What, what do we do with it? Read it. Hey, asshole. <laughs> the wasteland is a lonely, desolate place. We've been looking in on you and you think and think you might be a good addition to our clan. But before we take in another mouth to feed, you'll need to prove yourself worthy. Do this task and we'll consider taking you in. Crazy but still kicking Jake. Kill some male zombies. Wow. That's some, uh, some sexist, uh, quest. No, I'm kidding. All right, so I need to kill male zombies? Okay. <laughs> so it says, kill the infected survivor, kill a festering cadaver, kill a bloated walker, rotting carcass, and reanimated corpse. So, I- Oh my freaking shit. Oh, guys. That's a crossbow. That is a crossbow. That is a crossbow blueprint. Even better. That's a damn cr Oh my god, you guys. This is why I love this damn game. No matter how much stuff you find, you'll always find something better. And oh my god, it's so freaking cool. Okay, wait. There's gotta be better stuff in here. Let's see. What's the board about in here? Nothing. Medicine cabinet. Got some blood bags. That's good. And, oh, we found another wrench, but this one's a piece of shit. So we'll, we'll take the coffee beans. We're, we're good to go on that front. Got a toilet. What do we got? Murky water? Perfect. I'll take it. That's a metal door that leads out back. We'll keep it right there just in case. What? Do, 
Oh my, I've been a better mining helmet. Thank God. And garbage. Let's see. Yes, that's such a better mining helmet. Look at how much better that is, guys. Holy shit. We are sitting so pretty with equipment now. Holy crap. Okay, so it looks like there's a second room in here. So let's go ahead and break down these little windows right there. See, I think this is the, my favorite part about this game. Is all I'm doing is looting. It's so freaking fun. Wait, can I go in through the windows? I bet you I can. That's a much better way. That's a much better use of our time instead of wasting our time going through a door. All right, so let's see. Anything in here? I know you can break these things down and get cloth fragments, so that's what we're going to do. Look at how much cloth we're getting. Look at that! Look at that! Wait, is that cloth or leather? That's cloth. Okay, I was going to say. Holy shit. All right, let's see. Anything in there? Nope, nothing in there. Uh, how about here? Okay, we got some beer. That's good stuff. Uh, cash register. Can't go in there. Ooh, there's a bookcase. What do we got? Paper. Why? Ah, the damn paper. Frickin' menace, guys. Okay, so, gas station has been successfully looted. I think it's time to move on to the next buildings, guys. So, if I find anything crazy, I'll bring you guys back in. Look at all the pill cases, guys. Holy shit. Look at all of this. So, check this out. We got bandages and splints. I think each one of these is like a little box. Like, look at this. Like, one, one thing is a box. And there's stuff in every single one of them. Oh my freaking god. We got vitamins. We got uh, freaking painkillers. I'm about to drop some of this stuff. Like, oh, oh, and look at this, guys. We got sawed off shotgun schematic and leather boots schematics. We can go ahead and we can go ahead and read those and get rid of the uh, the space in our inventory. Now, I'm sure some of you are noticing how much beer I have inside of my inventory. I'm kind of an alcoholic, just a little bit. Let's see. We can go ahead and drop that. We don't really need that anymore. Um, let's see. What else can we drop? Let's see. We already learned those, and we already learned this, so we don't really need those anymore. Uh, truthfully, how much do these give you when you melt them down? Like, I, I've got half a mind to drop those. I'm not sure, though. Truthfully, we really don't need this much beer, but I want it. We don't need these potatoes. We don't need... We don't need this... Wait, that can of pasta has no negative side effects, does it? Wow, we'll go ahead and eat those right now. We'll go ahead and refill some of our food. Because it doesn't give you uh, thirst either, so that's a good thing. Let's see, we're going to keep the honey. We'll drop that. Um, that's pretty much everything that I want to drop. Everything that I'm willing to drop, I should say. So, let's just go ahead and take all that stuff. And I'll keep searching, guys. This is ridiculous, though. Like, the amount of stuff. Oh my god, what is that? A blood draw kit? Ha ha ha! Oh! Holy shit, guys. We're amazing. Like, this is amazing. Grain alcohol? Let's see. Does this... We're gonna drop all these little things of ham. We don't really need that. We've got plenty of meat and stuff back at the house. And we're gonna go on that front. Vitamins. We got more bandages and blood bags. Oh my freaking god! Look at all of this stuff. Like, what in the actual shit? How can we get so much stuff, guys? I don't get it. How are we getting all of this stuff? This is crazy. All right, well, I'm going to keep looting, guys. Hopefully, I can uh, figure out what I want to part with and uh, go from there. So, I'll see you soon. All right, you guys. So, inventory filled to the brim with holy crap amounts of stuff. I got to show you guys all of this stuff that I got from that place because I had to drop some things, but I think I kept everything that was crucial. So, inside of that store, I actually found a book that allows us to craft pistols, which is super freaking cool. Now... Let's start with... Actually, no. Let's start right here. This is the food chest, okay? So we'll go ahead and put in our bottled water. And we'll go ahead and put in our oodles and oodles of freaking beer. We'll put our blueberry pie in there. We'll put some potato seeds in there. And I think that's all of the food. Now, first aid kit. This is insane, guys. We have... How many bandages? Ten bandages. We have five. Ten. Or five, ten... That's 13 first aid bandages plus these, so that's actually 23 first aid bandages. We have all of those med kits. We have 20 med kits. We have over a freaking, oh my god, you guys. We have 33 painkillers, 22 antibiotics. We've got, how much grain alcohol? 14 grain alcohol. We've got, uh, let's see, 9 vitamins. We have 18 splints. Oh my freaking god. We have blood draw kits. 
We've got jars of honey out the butthole. 20 blood bags. Guys, we are sitting so damn pretty. We have three repair kits. We've got five gas barrels now. We've got ammo out the ass. Look at how much ammo we have, guys. That is insanity. And we've got some more trophies, some more chrysanthemum. Let's see, I'll put that in the, uh, the medical one. And we've got more animal hide, guys, as well as cloth. So, guys... I can absolutely, with 100% confidence, say that we are doing just freaking fine. And as night is setting, I think it's a perfect time to end off today's episode. So, with that being said, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And if you did, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more daily videos, and if you haven't done already, follow me on Twitter at CouchPotato1898. And I will see you guys next video.